Hi, I wanted to show you how to open a Kindle Fire 7 inch and this one here um, it's in here for repair um, it's got issues with the charging port and um, it is uh, pretty much dead uh, let's see the green light that's not a bad thing but it does not want to pop up a screen so uh, this is the first of a few videos that I'm gonna shoot and that son in the background is my little son playing on his iPad so anyhow um, I've been doing a lot of Kindle repairs on eBay and uh, a lot of questions and uh, the issue here is to repair this micro USB oops, micro USB connector alright before I can do that obviously I have to open this thing up usually what happens is that this micro USB connector um, it is a surface mount connector with two little um, through hole prongs and uh, the through hole prongs don't get soldered properly I uh, don't know if, if it's because of the lead-free uh, solder, but um, what happens is after a while they come off and they no longer charge. So, um, in order to open and uh, repair this thing, I want to point out a few things. First off, you see where these connectors are? That's where the motherboard is. Right here is the motherboard. Right here is the battery underneath. So, you're well off to start with a spudger. I'm using this spudger, my handy dandy spudger. Uh, and um, some cut up credit cards or plastic, what have you, uh, to wedge in. Uh, best thing is to hold uh, the Kindle like this because what you're trying to do, and uh, this is one of my first videos, so you have to bear with me, uh, trying to get you some information is to get the spudger where the speakers are you notice over there and um, get the spudger in at an angle mm, kinda like a inch and a half you kinda go in and you gotta kinda shove it in and it gets there let's try okay you got it it's a two-hand job so you go it in there and you pop it out and you pop it out and be careful so now um, you have the spudger in there and you carefully look at it make sure you're not in one of the wedges you see that okay now the idea would be to stick one of these up here the batteries right here the batteries right there so um anyhow so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pop a le little more of these tabs carefully let me pull that out just a little bit and then I'll pop this out pop this out there we go and you're gonna be obviously um obviously um you know your warranty is gone but your Kindle's not charging so Anyhow, over here, over here, let's get this a little bit more. Over here is the motherboard, like I said. So be careful. Be careful. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go away from the motherboard and pop a little connector there. Uh, done a few of these, probably at least 20, maybe more. I don't know. Didn't keep count plastic in, that's the battery over there that's a pretty safe spot to put the plastic mm, another one here alright so now it's nicely wedged over here is some more tabs and let's see if I can do this mm -hmm. so I'm gonna go around uh, lo and behold yeah I popped another one it's still pretty good the idea is to keep the tabs um, still intact so when you get to put it back it's still there so okay let's see what we got here I know there's a few tabs here and we're gonna try to get somewhere in the middle 
come up. Push in. Push up. Push in. Push up. Ah. Okay. The tabs are here and here. So, oh, pretty good. So far, so good. Anyhow, this one is kind of opening up. So, I'm going to play a little bit over here and see if I can get that to pop open. All right. That was good. Hopefully, I'm catching all this on this first video. All right. What I'm going to do is I'm going to slide another one of my handy dandy cut up plastic over here. I got that one. That one. Good. Good. All right. I'm getting somewhere. Hmm. All right. Here's the motherboard. Remember that. You kind of want to stay away from it, if I recall. Uh, the flex cable for the video and uh, the digitizer uh, is right here. So, um, even after having done so many, I've jabbed myself over there and been careful not to cut anything, but be careful. Okay, now I'm going to pop this up and going up. See how I'm holding it is um, the plastic, uh, the LCD over here and the backing over here because it's easier to pop up like this. Okay, so here we go. Here we go. All right. And voila. So we pop this up. And my son is happily playing platypus or something on his iPad. All right, so here's the tricky part. See over here, you don't want to jab it too hard. You want to kind of pop it. See, that's what I mean. There it is. There's the connectors right there. You see? Okay. And at this point, you kind of push it out. And voila. Okay. No cuts there. And we're good. And we got our uh, cover, back cover. The customer's customer already put his name on there. I'll set that aside. Now we got to deal with two issues here. The issues are okay. Here's the motherboard. You can see that. Let's see if I can, uh, without really shaking things, give you a good view of the motherboard. Okay, so that's the motherboard, and you got two screws here. Uh, you got uh, two screws underneath two here and two. So you got six screws, Phillips. Um, I use a double zero uh, Phillips screwdriver to get those off. Uh, that's the digitizer cable right there. You got a video cable right there. Sound. Uh, and oh yeah, Wi-Fi. Wi-Fi right there. Uh, power button connector, uh, battery. Before I do a single thing on this device, and on any device, um, iPod, iPad, whatever, um, Asus transformer, uh, first thing is to disconnect battery and power. First thing, never fails. That will save your life, and um, this is kind of not too hard. Um, what you got to do, I'll bring this closer, if you can see, is to take your thumbnails, and uh, I'm kind of used to this, so let's see how I can show you this. I don't know if I can show you this really well. Okay, we'll try. I think that's pretty good. Uh, like I said, it's my first video, and you kind of pull this thing out. You gotta be good at it. And there's the tabs, and you get that out. And uh, there's a metal spudger, so Lord help me. Uh, you get that off. Ah, power is now off. Power is now off. And as my son would say, hooray, hooray. Okay. So now, mm, let's see how we're going to do this. Um, the problem is with uh, the USB connector, which is right there. And you see those little, little solder points? 
that's the only two soldered in contact in this version of the Kindle Fire 7 inch. Um, I think it's a Rev F board, if I recall. Um, and those things uh, are pretty much popped out. They're not soldered in properly. I don't know why it happens that way. Um, maybe it's the stress, but the rest of these soldered in through hole points are soldered in. So, you can see that. So, mm, now, procedure. Uh, I haven't done a few of these and uh, spent 30, 40 years in electronics. Uh, let's see. I like to use my thumbs and um, thumbnails just because, uh, you know, it's a uh, sure way. Okay. Pop out the video. That's popped out. Pop out. Um, this cable here and that happens to be the antenna after that okay there's a little bit if you can notice so that is the uh, little uh, adhesive sponge pushing down on the wire going into for the speakers so just a second while I gather my handy dandy tool I'm gonna switch my glasses the way I work is uh, using uh, jeweler's glasses I love uh, getting in there and working kind of deep okay so if you go this side you can now see that I'm slowly pulling off Right there. Baby, baby, baby. Yes, there are. Yeah, that's my son. He's having fun, which is good. Uh, that's Microtech. He does the really serious stuff. Okay, so that's off. Now, uh, slowly, I'll show you how to um, take this thing apart. Okay. This also is wedged in there. And I happen to uh, work on every device thinking it's the only one I've ever worked on because they are. Because broken devices, they're kind of, you meet one and that's the only one you've met. Everyone's different. Uh, working ones, that's a different story, but broken devices each are unique and that's just the way it is, um, <laughs> the uniqueness of the break. Okay, so I've released one, two, three cables, actually four. I got five, six, seven. Uh, this one's easy. Uh, make sure you can see what I'm doing. Okay, okay. Uh, Herky jerky. And I'm gonna bring this down. Sorry. I apologize. Like I said, this is my first video. So I'm trying to get you some information. But it might be kind of herky jerky. Okay, all right. I'm gonna have to try again, as they say. And okay, let's just.